On Thursday, the University of Manitoba officially opened its new state-of-the-art dairy facility at the Glenlee Research Station south of Winnipeg. The 60-cal facility was made possible by a $2.2 million contribution from dairy farmers of Manitoba, with another $1.4 million invested through the federal and provincial governments. The discovery and learning complex includes new robotic milking and feeding systems, free stalls for dairy cattle, dedicated spaces for calves, milk collection tanks, and above-ground manure storage. Manitoba Agriculture Minister Ralph Eichler talked about the importance of the new research facility in a time where NAFTA and supply management are making headlines. It's all about being ready for the next step. That means we need to be even more on the edge of cutting edge uh, technology in order to ensure that we have uh, a safe marketplace for our products. Operations Manager Tracy Gilson talked about some of the research that will take place at the new facility. Big interest to the dairy farmers is, is mastitis. That's a, uh, a production limiting uh, problem with, with dairy cows, or, or can be. So we have a, a level two metabolism unit, which uh, really allows us to work with uh, pathogens like the, like the mastitis bacteria that will, uh, the, the researchers will then determine what kinds of treatments uh, that, that um, serve best to, to eliminate the problem. Other projects planned include identifying best management practices for high-quality Canadian silage production and exploring the efficacy and safety of hemp products. In addition, the new dairy complex will enhance teaching and outreach through a viewing gallery and public exhibit space and provide visitors with a rare opportunity to engage with modern dairy production. For the Manitoba Farm Journal, I'm Corey Canute.